Welcome to Sports Box, uh, April nineteenth, two thousand sixteen, and um, game ones are all underway. I have a C Max in with me right now, and we're going to discuss. How you doing? <laughs> we're going to discuss uh, tonight's games, which are uh, the Memphis Gri- Grizzlies versus San Antonio Spurs. Um, okay, so I got a question for you, C Max. What are your thoughts? On that, okay. Just tell me who's gonna win tonight: the Spurs versus the Grizz. Well, I have to take uh, the Spurs. Okay, Spurs. Didn't they beat uh, the Grizz by forty points the other game? Yes, they did, sir. Yeah. So, I honestly I can't see uh, the Grizz um, coming back from this at all. If you get blown up by forty points, that's pretty bad. Right, and so like at the end of the day, you can't you can't do that, right? So I'm thinking, like, w- w- what are your thoughts? Uh, is that going to go game seven, game six, five, or is it a clean sweep? I think this will be a clean sweep for uh, the Spurs. Okay, they're just uh, too much, too well, much experience. Actually, you know what? That's funny because Leonard just got the Defensive Player of the Year award off the Spurs, mm-hmm. and they have all that experience, <clears throat> right? The the coach. Don't forget about. Oh the coach. yeah, the coach Popovich. Well, who? Uh, how can how can you forget about Popovich, right? This guy is uh, like a methodical genius. At the end of the day, like, um, I I can I can see them going to the Western Conference Finals um, versus the Golden State Warriors. Um, okay, so let's talk about uh, the other game tonight, which is Atlanta Hawks versus Celtics. Who is your pick on this one? This is this is like a toss up. Okay. That is a toss-up. I, I honestly don't know. Um, so Atlanta <laughs> won the first game by one point, right? Ooh. So I honestly don't know, but like um, the Celtics are so young, they have no experience, like none, right? The Atlanta Hawks, uh, Horford went insane last or the last game. So either way you look at it, um, oh, breaking news. Uh, Steph Curry just went under MRI, and there's no concern for his injo- injured ankle. So I, I'm, wow. gu- I'm guessing he's going to play the next game. Okay, well, okay, wow. we'll, we'll talk about that later. <clears throat> but I want to know your opinion on Game Two of Atlanta I, versus uh, Boston. This is a toss-up. This is a toss-up. Uh, I'm just going to go old school and just say Celtics. Celtics, eh? Yeah. Celtics on the road. Just, just, uh, yeah, just for a little upset. Okay, so t- t- tie it uh, one-one <coughs> series, eh? Okay, yeah, that's fine. Um, don't put any money, folks. Don't <laughs> yeah, put any money on exactly. That. Yeah, <laughs> don't don't <laughs> pull you, eh? <laughs> okay, so last night's games, you had Toronto versus the Pacers. Okay, Valanciunas went insane last night, which is good for Toronto. That's right? good. That's good. It takes the pressure <coughs> off. Uh, DeRozan. Oh, yeah. And... Uh, Cal Lowry. Yeah, Lowry, yeah. Only thing is, they were so absent yes, uh, in the game one. It seems like that's their history. Well, think... It o- seems past a uh, few years... Exactly. Uh, ...that they have made it to the playoffs. It seems like they have excellent regular seasons. Yeah, yeah, that's all. And once they get to the playoffs, they seem to be... I don't want to say choke artists. Mm-hmm. But they they're just also very uh, young. Yeah. And we'll see. The thing no is, experience. Valanciunas had twenty three points last night, right? Yeah. <clears throat> Kyle Lowry eighteen. Yeah, I'll give him that much. It's okay, right? Mm-hmm. Pat Patterson surprised me. He had fourteen. Uh, Corey Joseph sixteen. But the person that surprised me was DeRozan. He went five for eighteen and only got ten points last night. Mm-hmm. Which is which is it's 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 okay. Well, that means that means maybe he will come back and hopefully he can redeem himself. But well, here's the thing: <clears throat> this guy's a free agent at the end of the year, right? So he you needs know. to show what he's got. Exactly, right? And the thing is, if if he if you're a free agent at the end of the year, you're gonna play like it's your last game, right? I don't know if you heard this, but it's between Toronto Raptors and LA Lakers. Which team wants him? He's from LA, mm. and to top it off. People say, like, even his agent confirmed it, Nike confirmed it. If he signs with L.A., his shoe deal will triple. 
So if he's making like uh, ten million off his shoes in Toronto, in LA alone, he's going to make thirty million. So you saying he's already thinking LA and uh, playoffs are not going to be? Uh, is it too much of a distraction for him? Uh, could be, maybe. You know what? I am really <laughs> thinking that. I mean, these guys are professionals. They should be, you know, concentrating on the game that they're playing. They it's should not, be. Not, nothing's written in stone, but. It could be a bit of a distraction for him. He's thinking, you know, L.A. and... Uh, well, think about it. This guy <coughs> makes like 12 mil right now, right? He makes 12 million, right? Yeah. But if L.A. shows him, oh, hey, we're going to toss up 21 mil to you right now if you sign with us, plus you're going to get 30 mil off your <coughs> deal mm-hmm. if you sign with L.A. Yeah. How could that... How could... It's got to be... It's got to take a very strong mind to... Not think about mm, that. Yeah, Toronto, LA, beaches. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. I think I take the 21 million. At, uh, yeah, LA, right? LA, why but not? <coughs> see, this guy's got to focus on the game, though, because at the end of the day, like, um, how often has uh, Toronto won? When's the last time Toronto went past the first round? I can't even remember. They, I think they did it once, but I can't. Uh, I cannot confirm that. Okay, what are your what are your? Was it when they had the Vince Carter? Was it that time they might have gone? Uh, well, actually, I think you're right. Yeah, I'm not too sure. Um, <coughs> so, what do you, who, who's going to win the series? That's a toss. Uh, like, that's a toss up too. I, I I want Toronto to win because this is their Canadian team. And right? uh, you know, usually when I predict one team, the other one wins. So I'm going to Pacers to win. <laughs> so you're going to make Pacers to win, okay? Good. That's quite the betting man, eh? You, you Don't got, put any money on that. <laughs> you got to quite the system going. <laughs> okay, so... Um, Golden State versus Houston Rockets. Uh, I give you that little bit of information. Um... Steph Curry, nothing wrong with his ankle, but they're going to arrest him. He didn't play last night's game. Well, they didn't need him last no, game, did no, they? <laughs> no, 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 clearly they didn't. But here's the thing. Houston, you have to admit, they have all this talent, right? They do. And the thing is, it's kind of like you have this drama between Dwight Howard and James Harden. And I, I, like, I was watching the Dwight game. Dwight Howard, he's having... Problems, drama, oh, problems everywhere. Doesn't everywhere he, where he goes, you know, right? he he had it. What was he? He was in. Uh, he was in New LA. Orleans. New Orleans was he? In no, New no, Orleans he was in, he was in the Lakers. Yeah. Then he went to the. Uh, uh, sorry, he came from Orlando. Orlando, right? right? And so he had that drama with Orlando. Then he had the drama with LA. LA. Lakers. And the thing is, it's it's not even a uh, a matter of um, a small team versus big team. It's mm-hmm. it's a matter <laughs> of. Uh, Uh, James Harden just won't get him the ball. Like, you know what I mean? I, I was watching the game, and I s- actually saw that Dwight Howard called for an alley oop, right? Yeah. And Dwight uh, James Harden threw it, but he threw it to the backboard. And mm. Dwight Howard was like, "Okay, like, dude, like, you know, you can at least give me the ball, right?" So. Uh, without without me telling you, guess how many shot attempts he had uh, yesterday, last night? Uh, is that Hardy? Or no, uh, Dwight Howard. Dwight? Um, shot attempts. Uh, I say 12? No. Seven. Seven? That's seven. it? That's it. Wow. Like, this guy is, like, <coughs> he's making 22 mil, and he's only making, getting seven shots. And guess, uh, James Harden got, because uh, he's controlling the ball, obviously, right? He got 19 shots, mm-hmm. right? So uh, that's a bit like... Uh, yeah, so one's way lower, one side the other right? one is... Uh, Even Trez- Tre- Trevor Ariza got 10 shots. Um, you know, it's... A, it's so at the what's end his of problem? What, what, what's James Harden the ball on? Oh. Well, like, <coughs> you know... I so got they have... Uh, yeah, they got, they, get, the, the, they got problems. Yeah, they have problems. They definitely have problems. Um, Let's talk about Golden State. 
Um, even without Steph Curry, they were managed to be Houston Rockets. 73 games, that's a record. Yeah, and at the end of the day, uh, Clay Thompson, 34 points, um, he went 15 for 16. So he was, I, I don't know what that is, but he averaged uh, like what, 60% shooting? Mm -hmm. That's pretty good, right? Um, so who's going to win this final? Or this series? This is a, this is a, I say four or five games. Five games, it'll five be, games uh, off, it'll, it'll, it'll be yeah, uh, a yeah. miracle, but uh, I have to give them, a, give them one game at home. Oh, really? Yeah, it's just, it's just the mandatory, I think. Just one game, maybe they could pull it off one game at home. I don't see, know. I, 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 I could see four games straight, but I'm just, I'm just trying to be nice. Okay? I, I, That's it. I'm going to stick to my original um, prediction, and that is uh, Golden State in four. Golden State four. Golden State. <coughs> that that that's a good prediction. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's a that's very good go, prediction. Go. I mean, with Curry not on that team, and they still hammered him. Yeah. Uh, don't need him. The, oh, there you go. They do. They should just rest him the whole uh, for the, the rest series. of the games. Yeah. Yeah. I don't. I don't see why would you play the guy. <coughs> hey, you got. San Antonio Spurs knocking at your door at the end of the uh, Western Conference Finals. So why not? Yeah. Right? Rest them for them. Exactly. Last but not least, we're going to talk about this one. Interesting. Very interesting. Mm. Dallas Mavericks at the OKC Thunder last night. Um, Dallas won. Wow. By one point. By one point. That's a win. That's a win. <coughs> right? So um, basically, who's going to win this one? Um, well, we have to give it to, um, is that, is that, that, uh, Nowitzki? Nowitzki's and, well, they, they're, they got good, uh, good experience. That's why they, uh, yeah, yeah, they can yeah. pull off uh, well, an upset here and there. Well, you know what it is? <coughs> it's kind of like this. Uh, OKC beat Dallas by 40 points in the first game, right? But now, like, you mentioned great coaches. Uh, like as in Popovich, well, I think Dallas has an amazing coach in Randy Carlisle. Uh, I believe that. Yes, right. He's because been around. Because the thing is, um, <coughs> sorry, Rick Carlisle. Because because uh, for to come back from that when you when half your team is injured, um, that's pretty that's pretty amazing. And so Nowitzki had 17 points last night. Darren Williams 13. Ray, Raymond Felton. Uh, Shocked me. It's 21, but Kevin Durant 21 points, we uh, Ru Russell Westbrook 19 points, and the rest of no, it's, it's <coughs> kind of it's kind of like you know it's a two man show. You yeah. know, OKC, right? So who do you have on in the, in these uh, in this final? Are they are they playing at the uh, next game is in Dallas. Next game's in Dallas. We have to go with Dallas on yeah. that game. Yeah, very I, uh, true. Uh, I predict that's going to be probably six games, maybe. Six games, eh? Yeah, six games. Who, who, but, who, who uh, I, I, would, I, I would say Dallas. You say Dallas to win? I would say Dallas will beat uh, OKC. OKC, yes. The next game or the whole the whole series? The series. The I series. say the series, I think Dallas will beat. I oh, think wow. uh, Nowitzki is going to be the difference. So after, you, <coughs> after, after what you saw last night, right? Yeah. You're going to say Dallas. Dallas. Um, you know what? I, at first, I, I automatically thought it was going to be OKC. Right? Yeah. Even even after seeing Game One, I was like, okay, this is OKC, OKC yeah. all the way. Yeah. But last night's game, that was kind of like, wow, right? You just beat um, OKC, and I I thought Raven Felton was done after like you know two seasons ago. But the guy got twenty one points last night. So I think Dallas has the experience. And also has the depth. Yeah, yeah, too. Yeah, because as you mentioned yourself, it's like uh, the OKC is a two-man two two show. show. It is. The depth off the bench is not really, you know. Exactly. Not that this strong. So uh, we're kind of close here uh, to ending time. Uh, let me just get your opinion on the Toronto Raptors' chances. Before we kick off, before we say goodbye. As I, as I said, it's, their chances is good. They should be hungry. I'm worried about the, the Rose. Uh, 
Is that DeRozan that wants to go to LA? Yeah. Or DeRozan. thinks might go to LA? Oh, yeah. That's yeah. always a bit of a distraction. I hope they can pull it off. Toronto in seven? Toronto in seven, yeah. Wow. Crossing fingers. <laughs> Knocking on the wood. Knocking on the wood. Okay, well, you heard it here, and uh, stay tuned next time to the Sports Box. Thanks again, C Mac, and Thanks we'll have you again next time.